tech rabbit here. We're gonna have a look in to see if we can um, expand our AC transformer build with a, um, a DC power supply option. So let's have a look at the components. So here's the AC um, transformer. And the two secondaries, fuse protection switches. Uh, I'll put a link to the build of this one. And then I thought we could connect with uh, these banana cables to the DC part. So let's have a look at some of the components. So we have the incoming side. The basically the end of secondary one, the end of secondary two, and then the center entry will be there. And then, um, of course, need to produce some kind of rectification it needs to be introduced because I am intending to use these little modules here, which are so-called buck DC converters. So they convert, uh, basically reduce the voltage. So have an incoming and an outgoing terminal and then you have two adjustable uh, potentiometers so one is to re uh, adjust the voltage and the other one is to adjust the current limit and there are many of these different configurations for sale uh, in the usual places some of them actually omit the possibility to regulate the current uh, and then uh, some of them are made for higher capacity um, this specific one uh, I'll put in the comments. This is an AC delivery uh, variant, and it um, it's rated for five amps, and the incoming voltage is um, eight to thirty-six volts. And then you can adjust the output from one point two five volts all the way up to um, thirty-two volts, depending, of course, on the limit of what you have in the input side. And um, since I actually would like, I would actually like to create a DC power supply that actually has a negative voltage. So there's actually going to be two of these. And my objective is to have a fixed voltage um, in DC power supply. So I'll probably adjust it to the standard um, 12 volts. And then on the output side. We will have ground, and it'll be plus 12 volts, and it'll be minus 12 volts, or something else who adjusts, so this is very flexible, so you can adjust it for different voltages. And then um, I think I will actually fuse the um, secondary also. Uh, optionally, I'm thinking of actually adding a fan with a uh, thermostat relay. And since I have them, I'll put a couple of extra capacitors on the um, secondary side to actually you know, stabilize the voltage. And then I'll um, invent some kind of a box for it also. Well, the next video related to this will be um, putting it together and um, testing it. So, Hope you join me in, in that. So I hope you found this informative. Uh, please consider subscribing or hit the like button if you thought you liked the video. Merch is available, or if you'd just like to buy me a cup of coffee, that's also possible. The links are in the description. And all contributions will be going to developing the channel. And uh, see you in the next one.